It was a bright and sunny day for the citizens of San Jo Tomas. Except for JD, Rico, and Eric. They may seem like normal people to you, but there's something you don't know about them. They all have. A sixth sense. <laughs> JD was just happily skipping around the bay of Edith's park until... JD won for his life <laughs> Rico, who knows first aid, approached JD and asked for his consent to help. First, he assessed the environment safety, then asked if JD was okay. He saw his friend Cray Cray with her out of this world phone that can take x-rays, so he asked for assistance. They found out that JD had a close fracture on the wrist. Rico and Craig Craig got the needed materials to stabilize and immobilize JD's fractured wrist. The materials they found were a magazine that was stable enough and was not flimsy, and two long cloths that can be tied around the magazine and JD's wrist. They placed the cloths and magazine under JD's forearm and asked him if he could turn his forearm. They then tied the cloth to secure the magazine. They asked if JD was okay and if he could stand. Then, they accompanied him to seek medical assistance. Eric is preparing for his early morning jog. Before jogging, he makes it a point to stretch first. But today, while he was stretching... Because of shock, Eric pulled back too hard on his shoulder and hurt his bone Eric cried for help. And help came. Cray Cray checked for the environment safety and asked if Eric was okay. Then she called Rico, who now has the X ray application as well. They found out that Eric dislocated his right shoulder. They looked for something to work as a support for Eric's shoulder. Luckily, they found a fairly large cloth that can work as a triangular bandage. Here, we can see Rika and Cray Cray applying the triangular bandage. Compared to what they did to Jaden, this procedure is easier. Just position the bandage properly. Clip the excess cloth. tie it around the patient's neck. Make sure that when you tie it, it is secure and not too loose nor too tight. Triangular bandages are important in treating a dislocated shoulder, so that the shoulder will not be pulled down further. Rico and Cray Cray asked if Eric was okay and if he can walk. Then, they accompanied him to seek medical assistance. On his way home, Rico saw his friend JD, but suddenly,
It was so fortunate that Kuba's friends, Jamie and Eric, who have now both recovered and their other friend, Cray Cray, was there to help him. They assess the environment safety first, then ask for Rico's consent if they can help. JD and Cray Cray looked for the needed materials, while Eric stayed with Rico and checked his vitals. JD found two pieces of wooden planks which they could use as splints, and a long piece of cloth that can be used to secure the splints on Rico's forearm. Luckily, Krikri just came from the grocery to buy her materials for her vital signs kit, so she went to her car and got the bag. Since Rico had an open wound, JD, Eric, and Krikri cleaned their hands with alcohol first. When an open wound is present, it is important to prioritize it. They cleaned Rico's wound with alcohol, then they dressed the wound with an unused sanitary napkin because it was the only material available. Then, they controlled its bleeding by applying pressure. Make sure not to apply too much pressure. Then, they proceeded to stabilizing and immobilizing Rika's forearm, using the wooden planks as splints and the long cloth to secure this. Again, make sure that this is secure but not too tight. Then, Eric called for medical help. After several months, Rico, Eric, and JD have fully recovered from their injuries. One night on their way home, Remember, first always examine the environment and its safety. Second, always ask the victim for permission to help. Third, assess the injury. A dislocation is a separation of a joint. A closed fracture is a broken bone that does not penetrate the skin. And an open fracture is a broken bone with skin penetration. Fourth, check the patient's vitals. And fifth, check if there are open wounds. If there are, prioritize controlling the bleeding. Don't touch me! Hey, hey, are you okay? Are you? 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 Are you?